At this building of the Fadre Technical and Vocational Training Institute in Ethiopia's capital, Addis Ababa, students could learn various technological skills. The facility houses the Ethiopian Lubin Workshop. Sometimes I'm working with the Lubin Workshop. So in Ethiopia, it's very necessary. Most of the students are uh, working with uh, and also practice with the uh, Lubin Workshop. That's very necessary and also important in our uh, institution. Over the years, the Lubin Workshop has become a symbol of China's commitment to sharing its advanced vocational education expertise with Africa, with more than a dozen similar institutions opened across the continent. To help African countries improve their medical services, China has dispatched medical personnel and provided medical aid to African countries for decades. In collaboration with the Comoros Anti-Malaria Center, the China Malaria Prevention and Control Project team in the Comoros has led malaria prevention efforts and related training since 2007. By 2017, experts from both nations had reduced the malaria incidence in the Comoros by over 99%, effectively eradicating malaria-related fatalities. Bon, uh, quand j'ai commencé à travailler avec uh, les Chinois, c'était en 2012. Et puis c'est en 2006 que je suis vraiment devenu euh, parmi les membres de l'équipe euh, chinoise pour l'élimination de publics en Comore. Et puis euh, en 2018, je suis parti en Chine. Et puis euh, à partir de là, souvent je pars en Chine pour des formations. Et euh, la plupart de la, des formations qu'on a fait, ce sont des formations qui sont liées à l'élimination des paradisme. Donc on a appris euh, l'expertise. Euh, et l'expérience de la Chine pour l'élimination des paradis en Chine.